We're thankful to everyone watching, everyone that stood with us. The family of 60-year-old Ali Elbana embraced one another outside the Juvenile Justice Center in Dallas Friday after a judge ruled the 16-year-old murder suspect identified as Cameron Range could be tried as an adult. Elbana's widow speaking publicly for the first time. Because we can't take back what happened to my husband, but we can speak out and prevent from it happening again to someone else's husband someone else's father, to someone else's brother. Elbana was fatally shot in the parking lot of the Costco Business Center located off Park Lane in Dallas in November of last year. The last victim in a violent crime spree that day that included the aggravated assault of three other people. Detectives say Range shot Elbana as he was loading groceries into his SUV. Three other suspects, all adults, were riding around in a stolen pickup truck looking for targets, police said. And they all went to the subway to eat a sandwich after they killed my husband. No remorse. It, it, it sickened me to know this. At Friday's hearing, the defense tried to convince the judge that Range would still face serious consequences should he be tried and convicted of capital murder in juvenile court. A licensed psychologist with the Texas Juvenile Justice Department said Range would be enrolled in what's called a capital offender program geared towards rehabilitation. But in closing arguments, the prosecution pointed out that Range has been in the juvenile justice system since he was 12 years old and was already on probation wearing an ankle monitor at the time he allegedly murdered Elbana. In her ruling, the judge said Range was, quote, willful and violent and added that the public needs protection ordering he be sent to adult court for trial. And this is um, a small victory to say the least, but using the word victory of course doesn't feel right.